All right, time to talk weather once again with Chief Meteorologist Jeremy the Good. Jeremy, I don't know if you know the answer to this, but I'm still going to ask you. Do they make children's books about weather? Like cloudy with a chance of meatballs, something like that? Totally, dude. We got to teach kids about weather right away because, you know, you go outside, you look up, you see clouds. What do you do? You just keep doing what you were doing. You <laughs> see thunder and lightning. That's when things change. Oh, yeah, I got those kids covered. Don't worry. We are dry the rest of the week. Temperatures on the rise, but hey, just a quick word of note. Somebody's got to tell you, don't forget your mom. Mark, yesterday said, what'd you do for your mom? Today, I can confidently say I got her flowers, wrote her a note. It's a thing. I took care of it. Dang. She'll probably think it was my sister because it's actually being done. So yeah, that's, I mean, my mom too. I, during Christmas, I'd be like, oh, can I put my name on that gift too to my sister? She'd be like, no, get out of here. Oh, I know. Sisters. You need to be better. They need to be better. All right, big ridge of high pressure building off to our west. That's what takes over weather. We don't have to really worry about the forecast. There's not much going on. In fact, it's just going to be serious temperatures on the rise. We settle into the 80s on Friday and stay there all weekend long. Even tomorrow, 76 degrees. That is going to feel incredibly warm. By Friday, 80 degrees, you're going to go, I need to fire up the barbecue or something. Our ridge of high pressure that builds overhead really hits tomorrow. So that's when we're going to notice that bigger jump in temperatures. We get both sunshine and that sinking air. That combination is what warms us up into the mid 70s. Because nothing changes, we then have the opportunity to warm up. We talked a bit about this earlier in the week. The pattern that we are heading into is akin to the pattern that brought us 70s all the way back in March. Remember, we did that all the way back in March. This is a similar story, but we're now at the time of year where when we get that big pattern shift, it equates to temperatures in the 80s and not the 70s. And we stay there all weekend long. So really not much to talk about. The overall weather pattern does call for some seriously warm temperatures. 76 tomorrow, 80 on Friday, 82 Saturday, 81 on Sunday. Sunday is Mother's Day. If you order your flowers right now, they will arrive to your mom on Saturday and you don't have to worry about paying for that Sunday delivery. That's another pro tip. Next week as temperatures fall back into the 70s, that's still above those seasonal norms.